Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Assalamu alaikum my dear students Today we will study housing of sheep and goat What does one square fit means So selection of site all sheep and goat house is a sheep and goat house is also called shed a shed should be constructed on elevated place to avoid rain and flood waters uh, drainage bees may easy hoti hai it should be easily accessible it should be surrounded by trees to provide shade to the animals always make a simple shed with low cost material as animals are stupid they cannot differentiate between a well painted house or no painted house so direction and uh, attributes of shed uh, it should be east west lengthwise north south widthwise the roof should be 10 feet high in the middle and uh, 12 feet high on sides uh well you can make it 12 here and 10 here so it should be 12 feet high in the middle and 10 feet high on sides shed could be made paved or unpaved aap ek kachcha shed bhi bana sakte hain mitti se bana hua aur lakdi se bana hua ya phir isko aap concrete se bana sakte hain there must be adequate uh, air circulation and sunlight a fresh water tub should be available all the time and provide 5 feet long movable mangers manger is called a feeding feeding material khurli jise hum kehte hain so we must provide this thing here so this is a typical uh, a sheep farm and uh, in one of our uh, uh, livestock and dairy development department farm so uh, there is open space there is covered space so it is a simple design for sheep housing uh, you must understand that sheep and goats they go for grazing all day and when they come back they only need housing at that time so for those for their night stay or their evening stay we need this sort of shed so this is another view of the same uh, uh, here it is uh, uh, showing mangers you can see the uh, metallic mangers they they are movable one is here one is here one is here so uh, if you want to provide vanda or fresh water uh, or fresh feed in uh, in these mangers Uh, these can be used so a uh, space requirement for one sheep or one goat is 12 square foot covered space or uh, room space and 24 square foot open space and this makes 36 square foot total area required by a sheep or a goat and if you want to make a shed of 100 sheep and goat this would require 3600 square feet total space it includes open as well as uh, constructed area so uh, for goat housing i have three types of housing floor goat housing system i have already described on this so a goat will uh, be uh, staying on the floor and they have some covered area as well as they have some open area they have some uh, uh, well or hose for water uh, drinking water floor goat housing second type of goat housing is is over the pole goat housing so we make an elevated floor uh, one or one and a half meter high uh, from the ground and then build a shed on it so this is very uh, nice system for uh, housing sh- goat because goat are very uh, y- you can say uh, they like cleanliness they they like clean environment so drainage would be easy their urine or dung they it would come here down and we can easily clean it and uh, it is also it provides a lot of fresh air a lot of ventilation so this is a better uh, uh, a type of housing system where uh, the the land is 
watery or moist so moist land environments this is uh, one of the method of housing over the pole goat housing and the next is uh, 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 concrete housing system so we can make concrete house it is uh, a bit costly we usually don't recommend this because uh, I have already told you animals are stupid, they don't differentiate between a good house and a bad house. So we will just provide them enough for their. And similarly for sheep, uh, you can have an open, he's, uh, open sheep housing system. In this system we just, uh, we have no roof. The sheep will just uh, divide it uh, into fences and uh, the, the only material we will use here is fences. There will be no roof. This is used for uh, areas where uh, there is less rain, less environmental hazards. So this is open sheep housing. And second method is semi-open uh, sheep housing. Here we will uh, make a simple shed in the middle of the the the, the farm, and uh, the other uh, places would be open. So if sheep need some sort of uh, shade, she can utilize that. Uh, so this is called semi-open sheep housing and the last one is uh, bound sheep housing this is uh, we will make a complete uh, roofed and well managed house for sheep sheep will stay in there in, in, during their evening stay and uh, we will have to make it uh, uh, airy and uh, we will provide them ventilation and uh, heating system and everything according to the temperature so this is a bit costly system but this is very good for for their night stay so uh, my dear students in this lecture we have uh, studied about uh, sheep and goats housing systems there are required space required by them there are different ways of housing them and uh, it would depend upon our area and our resources which type of housing we will recommend Thank you very much for your attention. If you have any question, you can contact me via email on WhatsApp or you can simply call me. Thank you very much for your attention.